How's the pack feel? All right. I'd like everyone to notice that he's carrying a bow currently. <laughs> we'll see how long that lasts. I have no loyalty to this. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just start off right at the bottom. Sierra? What's up? How you feeling? Feeling good. Just packing my face wipes. <laughs> and hopefully, we'll take that plane out for a ride soon. You have some, Brady? What? Crampons. No. I don't need crampons. <laughs> Famous last word. <laughs> last thing we see on that camera. Is sky, yeah. brush, sky, <laughs> rock. That'll be fine. Sure. <laughs> I'm a good enough hunter to kill other animals that I don't need to eat a bear. Hashtag remains to be seen. <laughs> Would you like to borrow my weapon? <laughs> so it's the end of my guide season. I've guided, been guiding doll sheep and grizzly bear for the last few weeks. And these suckers decided they wanted to come up and hunt. So we drew a goat tag. Isaiah's got a tag. Sierra's got a tag. It's a permit only tag. And since they're non-residents, they have to be accompanied by a guide. Yours truly. So we're getting ready to fly out to our goat area. It's awesome weather today. Just hope it holds so we can land on the ocean and begin a hunt we've waited quite a while for. Get him. It's Alaska. Relax. <laughs> Y'all look very ready. I am just soaking oh, right in this knuckle, little bit dude. of sun we have left. <laughs> like a lizard. Austin and our pilot are going over weather. He's slightly concerned about the wind where we need to land tonight, but hopefully it's not a big deal. And we are out of here in just a couple minutes. So hopefully we get loaded up and in the air. When I first started hunting, I never imagined I would have the opportunity to shoot a mountain goat. I thought, you know, I was just this little Indiana girl who would shoot deer and ducks her whole life. I remember chatting with my friends and having those wouldn't it be cool if conversations. And for me, they always just came back to mountain goats. This idea always seems like a dream. It seemed unattainable. I was talking to Jared Lyle one day and he told me he had a plan. So I put in as a party with Isaiah and somehow we drew two out of the four non-resident tags in the unit we wanted in Alaska. Well, Jared's plan worked for one. I don't want to give him credit for it, but it did. And all of a sudden, a lifelong dream of mine was about to come to fruition. Made it. We made it. Wait till. Oh. Oh yeah. Nobody told me it. It's important to have. <laughs> it is. Thanks. <laughs> Austin sent me that text and I could not I know. Not I was like, laugh. will you text him? Tell Hopefully him to get my bowl out of right. my gun case. Yeah, <laughs> At least I remember. Um, good move. Good timing. Yeah. Enjoy some scenery back over the mountain. Definitely going for it. Always a sobering feeling when the plane leaves and it just gets quiet and you're stuck.
Mask up for safety, Brady. This Mask. is still COVID Mask 2021. Up for bugs, buddy. There <laughs> go. That one on the back of my neck's about to sink his teeth in. Ow! <laughs> Whoa, up? it's a little shit. <laughs> <Yeah, that's> <laughs> Don't take any sharp turns. <laughs> There we go, 73 pounds, folks. The AAA. I added water, too. Ooh. Time for some flames, Dizzler. We gotta shut down the mist factory. Remind it who's boss. <laughs> the flames kill. Got me a good snack here, Judy. <laughs> oh, yeah. Camel guys gotta eat. I'll show you a pro tip here. For some reason, the weather on your inReach is like super accurate. So, what we're gonna check here is our wind direction. 30% chance of cloud coverage, wind out of the south. Go forward to tomorrow, east, northeast, wind by 11, east wind at five. We know the wind's coming from the east. We're gonna plan our camp spot, so we're in a decent spot to make an approach, but not get winded too early. Got some biscuits and gravy tonight. I know it's a breakfast meal, but I figured I'd be naughty. It's really good. What? It is so good. What are you doing? I'm warming my hands. <laughs> I love these things. They're awesome. Your hands? <laughs> <laughs> I love my hands. They're awesome. Keeping up with tradition, I always eat beef pasta marinara the night before opening day. Since, I like it. since we flew today, tomorrow is opening day. I always eat my favorite first. That way, if a bear gets me tonight, I go out on, <laughs> go out on top. <laughs> I go out with a good meal. <laughs> Makes it kind of hard to do your job when your lens is foggy at the very beginning of the day. We're having phenomenal weather, so we decided we'll leave our spike camp here and just go light and fast and see if we can get on a goat. That's the plan. Can't see any from camp here, but it's probably a good thing. Morning, Brady. Nice of you to show up. <sighs> Beautiful day in the neighborhood. Did you forget something in your tent? Yeah, I left my sunglasses. And I think I'm going to need them today. I think you're right. So I went and grabbed them. Figured I'd catch Austin anyway. He's slow, out of shape. Your typical sheep guide. <laughs>
and he's in a he's in a good spot to stock with the bow. So we'll glass a bit and then make a game plan on what we want to do. A bunch of nannies and kids just right over here too. So we'll have to wait for them to clear out before we even decide to head over there. Slope and that little ski came from that green knob. He just appeared. Nice Billy. I see her. I was like, What's that go? And I'm like, Oh my gosh. Waiting on a goat. Gotta have good snacks. Oh, oh shit. Mm. That's as good as it gets. Hey Austin, how long do you think you'll be bedded down? One hour and 15 minutes. He's gonna get up for a switch. And we're gonna kill him. I like it. For now, we feast. Nine. When he stops, just put it right on his. MOA is nine. Yep. Okay. Put it right on his heart when he stops. It. Good shot. You want to hit him? Reload. Okay. You want him? He's dying. He's dead. Dead goat. <laughs> nice job, Sierra. That's where we got to pack him out anyway. He's going to start right here. <sighs> Sierra. <laughs> dead goat. <laughs> nice. Good job. Good shot. That, yes. Now, that is ideal. <laughs> Air, air high five. <laughs> he lost a horn. He did. He did. 
You saw it? First fall. Like, we're going to have to go up and look for it at oh, the... God. Yeah. <laughs> I've looked for horns before. Come here, buddy. <laughs> That's awesome. Come here, Sierra. That's so pretty. That's sweet. Good <laughs> shot, so man. Nice like, shooting. <laughs> I just wanted both of, I wanted the one horn to stay on. I kept watching, I'm like, keep that guy on. <laughs> we don't want to look for two horns on that mountain. I woke up in the middle of the night, open my eyes in my own mind. Wow. That's a big goat. That's a big body. Woo! <laughs> yeah, look at that. That's an old goat, man. He only had one tooth there, though. Yeah. Left. There's only one hole. That one was busted before. My That's guess up on the hill was six and a half. Right? <laughs> <laughs> that is a stud. Look how big he is. Look how pretty his fur is. Oh, of course. Yeah. That does look like a long ways up there now. I feel really I don't. <laughs> well, one eye to the rescue again. Got ourselves a goat horn recovered. These things can get pretty expensive. <laughs> Sierra's going to spend a fortune on that, isn't she? All right. Well, that should make a Ms. Langbell pretty happy. Let's get down there and get some pictures. Oh my gosh. Why'd you shoot a such a heavy goat? <laughs> Ready? One lift. Cut her done. Right there. She's a wild one. You find it? Yeah. What's the word? Yeah. No. What does a replica cost? <laughs> you guys did find it. Stop being <laughs> <laughs> Look at <Whoa>! the <laughs> Look, we found his horn. <laughs> That's the best. Look at that. Like, wow. 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 <laughs> yes. Sweet. Thanks, guys. You're welcome. Isaiah's like, we're not giving it to her right away. You guys had pretty good poker faces. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> well, we were tired. Like, it's, it's easier when you're tired. Ooh, nine and three eighths. It's like nine and three eighths. I don't even know how to describe it. <laughs> <laughs> Not dream of you. Freaking drop them. Easy. Well, Joner, that's a wrap on Sierra's goat. Yep, we got her out of the way. <laughs> <laughs> we officially have Sierra's goat all boned out. Brady's already hauled some meat halfway back to the top of the ridge, so we're gonna sneak up through that saddle, just see what it's like, see if we can see any goats. If we kill a goat, Brady's not gonna be too happy. <laughs> <laughs> Night adventures. Can I tell you what, it is so much better hiking in the dark when it's not raining. I'll take dark hunting than rain hunting any day. I'm on him.
tell me before you shoot. I'm moving. Here we go. Ready? Yep. Good hit. There he is on the snow. Wait for him to cross it. Smart. Wait for him to get up the other side. Dude, have you ever seen a fluffier goat? <laughs> you smoked into the water. <laughs> Told myself I wasn't gonna cry. <laughs> you just killed the furriest mountain goat. And he's not even gonna be bloody, bro. <laughs> Good job, dude. <laughs> <laughs> A bucket list <laughs> on a mine for a long time. <laughs> wow, what a goat! <laughs> yes, dude, good <laughs> shot. Can't say I expected that to happen. <laughs> <laughs> Took a 400 yard shot <laughs> with my bow. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that hide. Six, five, five and a half. Oh my goodness. Hi, baby. Yes. I just shot a stomper goat. No. <laughs> he was too big and fluffy to pass up with, with the bow, so. <laughs> Life's so cold. I am gonna go over and look for a way out. See if we can get around this mountain or if we have to go over it. Well, this is the part that they were worried about. It looks like we'd be good to go. That's all. Oh, this is gonna suck with a heavy pack though. It's a lot of this for a long one. The whole idea of any hunt in Alaska is really just when the weather's good. You hunt as hard and as diligent as you can. Because undoubtedly the weather's gonna suck. <laughs> if it doesn't suck yet, just wait. So we killed two goats in just a few hours because the weather was good. All right, loaded heavy. Brady's got half, Jonah's got half. I got the other half. Oh! <laughs> There's something about watching Jonah struggle that just makes my soul uh, happy. Where's the water bottle go? Hey, here's our heavy load test for uh, Kuyu versus Mystery Ranch versus Exo. They all suck when they're heavy, Brady. Biscuits and gravy is one of my all-time favorite mountain house meals, so I was afraid people would have it up. Getting the little biscuits and gravy over here, Brady. Austin? What? What's the uh, situation? Well, since this has been a how to hunt in Alaska, when the weather's good, you hunt, and when the weather's good, you can also fly. So we called the pilot to see if they could bump up our pickup date a few days. And they said, get your butts to the beach. So here we go. If we don't make it, what are we facing? 
60 to 70 mile an hour winds and rain the next two days and maybe a pickup on Saturday after that. <laughs> Pro tip, when you got 10 pounds, six days worth of snacks left and you're packing up camp, you gotta eat them all. That way your legs are coming down because that's how that works. Miserable. <laughs> that's the only word. Look at that. Hey, good thing you got a dry bag. Yeah, I can carry water off in it. Uh, Guess what? We get to do that all over again. Up uh, and down. A lot lighter, though. Back up the mountain we go. Another load. I'm old. I'm over it, but I'm good. I'm glad I have dry boots and socks down here. <laughs> you think we're getting out today? When I get on the plane and buckle and he powers on, then yes. But not until then, we don't know. I'm gonna go for a swim. I gotta cool the f off. <laughs> There's nothing like the feeling of accomplishing a lifelong dream. Things don't always go as planned in hunting, but when it all comes together, it is oh so sweet. I am so thankful for everyone that helped me on this hunt, but most of all, I am thankful for a life that lets us embark on these incredible adventures. I'll give you guys the brief real quick when I get her fired up. <laughs> <laughs>